Hey you guys, uh, Brian Paul, standing here in VR as always, picked up my move controllers, aka my hands off the floor, there we go. Uh, let me get in here, recalibrate, as the swordsman in VR, hell update, and yes, hell is spelled correctly, I was just not a without parole spelling mistake, although you'd be very right to believe that that's a possibility. Um, I did turn the brightness up just a little bit to kind of mimic what's going on in the headset a little bit more. Um, so if you see other streams that have this much darker, that's the reason. What's up, Jamie Out? What's up, Jupiter Skies? What's up, Jason Ewing? What's up, Stinger X? Lots of cool cats here, guys. I don't. This is going to be a long stream. I've got a lot to get done tonight. I've just worked on a bunch of projects at once. But as soon as uh, Josh told me that this was a, this was uh, ready to go, that this was up. I had to jump in and check this thing out. So this is our new boss fight. Actually, before we do that, let's uh, real quick. Let's read this real quick here. Uh, we got patch notes, lots and lots of bug fixes, improved blood appearance, samurai color, just a little easier to penetrate with axes. All right, I think we're okay. What's up, Dead Ringer? Lots of cats here. Love it. All right. So yeah, I got a shield and uh, I think like the one of the better swords you can get. Uh, so this environment is all new. Hey, chill, lady. I didn't even get to pick up my swords yet. Here, I'm totally gonna die. I'm totally gonna die. Oh, this sword is so heavy. This sword is so much heavier than it used to be. Whoa, what are you doing behind me? You will rot in this mortal realm. <laughs> oh, where are you? Where are you? You're right there. Oh, no! <laughs> Alright, these always take a little time to get used to. The, the sword weight is so much heavier than I remember. That must have been uh, an update. Let us see how true it's, it's very... Sans and Sinners-y. Man, she does not like to give me my space, that's for sure. Oh. Yeah, lady, make sure you say something every time you appear, huh? Say something when you appear. What's what's up, that guy? Yeah, man, Hellsplit Arena is not coming to PSVR. It's coming to PSVR 2. That's the news. They announced that a while ago. Uh, we announced that a while ago too. Uh, man, what's up, Nine Lives? Guys, this is <laughs> this is crazy. Uh, I don't I don't. This is gonna take some time, I think. Maybe there's a, maybe there's a a trick here I need to work on. I need to I need to work on backing up. I'll tell you that. Not following social distancing, but she does have a mask on, so I'll give her that. Can I fall off the edge? I think I can fall off the edge. Can I push her off the edge? That'd be way easier than fighting her. There is a sound when she reappears, so I could maybe listen to for that and stop talking so much. Hey, give me my sword. Give my shield back. Whoa, whoa! I didn't hear her reappear. I was, I was. <laughs> See how I didn't move? I was just quietly listening for her to reappear. Uh, that guy is, uh, that news was a while back, man. You will so, uh, so I can totally see that one being an easy one to miss. They, they went back and forth on Hellwoods or Hellsplit or God damn, there's so many Hell games I can't remember them all. Yeah, this doesn't feel quite as refined as the uh, as the pirate update. I'll tell you, I'll say that. Um, but we'll see how it goes. Man. Like I'm just I'm just getting the hang of it. Oh, jeez, get out of here, lady. We got a health bar, man. Just trying to go for the knees. Ah, oh, man, 
And it's really like, I think it's one hit kill. I think it's one hit and I'm dead. I think so. I think it is. You will find no mercy. Right, I gotta keep an eye on my, uh, my special here. Make sure that... That didn't seem to register at all. Oh, yep. Well, I guess that answers that question, doesn't it? You can indeed fall to your death. <laughs> uh, so the thing about this was that it's... What did he say? This this two elements never... Is it, is it, there, it's a two-tiered stage. So I guess maybe when we get to the halfway point, we'll see the other the other half? I don't know. Um, and there's an, a gameplay mechanic not seen before in Swordsman, but we have seen the whole following before in... Uh, in Claws. Uh, so, I don't think that that's what he was referring to. If I just stand by the edge, maybe she won't uh, be able to get me from behind. Because I can just do this. Get out of here, lady. Ah, oh, she can't fall, I guess, because she can just disappear. So pushing her off the ledge is not a gameplay option. Hey, where'd my sword go? I'm... I don't have a sword or a shield. Alec, come save me! I just have to get killed, I guess. That sucks. Yeah, I guess the new element could be the blinking she's doing. I'm surviving much longer without a sword or shield, I'll say that. I wonder what's up these stairs. <laughs> Anybody home? Let me in. What up, snacks? Grab hers. Right? I mean, I guess I could just... Nah. Ah, nah. I could be like a... Like a your standard YouTuber and really get over dramatic. Like, no! Let us see how true your And the hit detection is not going over well here. Like I am slamming that against her head, and I'm not keeping an eye on the on the health bar, on the HP bar. But fuck, man, it's like it doesn't feel like it's a stinger. I don't think I can, man. She just she just disappears. So I don't think I can just. See, this takes care of the weight issue if I if I double fist it. But then I don't. What's tomorrow? Big fan, big day for us horror fans tomorrow. What's tomorrow, bud? Did I miss something? Wait, it's to Oh shit, tomorrow tomorrow is Tomorrow is uh affected. I forget tomorrow's affected, man. I gotta talk to those guys. We had too many things in the works, you guys. Too many things in the works. I forgot that tomorrow was actually Tuesday. See, that was a pretty, pretty heavy hit that just didn't register. You will find. Uh, after afterlife is on Thursday, man. Yeah, I'm gonna have to change the swords. I'm gonna have to go back into my into my swords and, uh, and work on that a little bit. This is 
not the uh, this is not the correct weapon combination to take care of her at all. So yeah, let's let's go take care of that. Yeah, I think oh no, affected manner is tomorrow, um, and then the day after is Wraith the Oblivion Afterlife. Um, I'll have my review ready for Wraith uh, when that comes out, but I might just have to stream affected. But, but, but if only there was a video that told us when all these things were coming out. If only there was a video. Yeah, maybe. I can spot a sportsman a thousand pieces. It's 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 too late at night for my brain to work properly. My brain doesn't work properly anyway. But uh, I mean, I could use the gun sword, right? Uh, and kind of keep her at bay. In fact, it is the 28th. Okay, man. Good stuff, good stuff. Yeah, the competition details will be out, I think, tomorrow. I don't know, man. Again, uh, all my dates are all jumbled up in my head. All of that shit is in a video somewhere, <laughs> so that I don't have to remember it. Uh... <sighs> okay, you know what? So let's, uh... Gonna go two swords here. It's not probably not gonna go very well, but let's give it a shot, man. You get an ad for swordsman when you clicked on this? Wow, some that's some proper branding right there. Pro proper uh, ad advertisement targeting, for sure. All right, so this is uh, one one of these swords will help me heal faster, and the other one will hopefully keep her at a distance. But we'll see, man. Uh, you will find no this one at least here. is less weighty. No mercy here, but I want mercy here. Whoa! Nothing. Uh, I guess I should have checked the, uh, all the mods, make sure the right ones are on, but what are you going to do? Not sure, I didn't check the... HP bar. You will rot in this mortal realm. I have to defeat her to get her weapons. So if there's a sword missing, that's the reason. I just want her ability to disappear and shoot me. That'd be way cooler than any of the abilities I have. Making a little bit better progress with two swords instead of uh, instead of one. She does make a sound every time she appears, so I don't know what's going on when I don't hear the sound. Got this. Oh, Midge! I must get her off the ledge! <laughs> it would be cool for this game to have lightsabers. There we go. Huh. I'm sorry, was that Goro? Guys, I think the second part of the stage is about to begin. I think that's Goro. <laughs> oh, wait a minute, hold on a second. Story. Hmm. Okay. Well let's check the uh let's check the menu then. Ba da ba 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 Um
Yep, here we go. This is it. The Reaper. Forged in the Realm of the Dead. The Reaper allows you to jump in and out of your perceivable dimension. Of our perceivable dimension. I have to read that. To claim its power, you must defeat health. Done. The Goddess of the Underworld. Click. Um, so let's equip that and see how it works. I mean, that's going to be interesting, right? That was it. That, that was the boss fight, you guys. Um, felt, it was a little rough around the edges, I think, but uh, but it was still cool. Uh, but th th the important thing is, how am I going to be able to use this now? So uh, let's go into modes. Let's go have a fun... Let's, let's, go, let's go try the horde mode, see if we can bounce around the horde map a little bit uh, with this new ability that we have. Uh, I'm assuming it has to charge up, just like... Uh, here it is. Let's go look at it in the light. That's it. Probably get a charge up. I don't know how to use it. I don't know how to use it. Ooh, wave two. This is so exciting. This mode alone is better than their first game, Wraith. The environments are at least better. You can move around. You guys ever play Wraith? First in studio game? Kind of cool. I mean, not worth buying, but some of the ideas were kind of cool. Uh, it, it was very much a stand in one place shoot bad guys kind of thing. I just tried to throw the dagger at him, that didn't work. Uh, <laughs> I don't any tips on how to beat the bosses. Uh, you think we need daggers in both hands? That's a possibility. Hey, you know what? Since it doesn't seem to be doing anything, let's, uh, let's end and see. Oh! Uh, poor guy. Poor guy. I still haven't platinum in this game, you guys. Um, I've got 100% of all the goals completed, but... I just have to grind away here. Um, Alright, let's, let's make sure we're... Never a dreary day. We're dual wielding this thing. This is a special item you cannot dual wield it. You can enable dual wielding in the same. I think, so somebody was asking about advice on how to beat the bosses, I'm pretty sure that the, uh, alright, so this is the, so I think this is, the Stormbringer is the, uh, is, is the weapon you get from the second boss. Um, and so, whatever the ice level is, maybe that's the third, I forget, but this is the boss you want to take down first. Once you have this sword, uh, everything else is super crazy easy. Um, so we're going to use that just for funsies, and then this should be in our right. Alright, let's, let's take a look at the mods here and make sure that everything is where it needs to be. Modifiers. 
Ooh, what do I have on that's taking me down 30%? Something must be on from... Oh, that's interesting. My right hand has been so shaky today. Look, this is me holding down the trigger. It's just my, my hand's just shaking. I think I think Beat Saber did me in. Uh, <laughs> uh, hopefully tomorrow I'll be back to normal, but otherwise uh, games are going to get hard to play if I shake all the time. Um, here, let's see. Bye, no shielded enemies. Enemies don't dash. Remove the curse to uh, wield the same boss sword. I mean, might as well, right? You know, to break boss next. Oh, nice. <sighs> Let's see. Boss weapons special instantly recharge for you. Cool. Okay, so there we go. So now we're gonna like really see if this thing. There we go. Left and right. Look at that handsome devil. He's got two daggers. Um. Just pick a random one here. Play it again. Oh man, this is going to be super bright on the screen uh, because I already turned the brightness up. Let's see how bad it looks. Oh, it's actually not that bad. I'm going to leave it on. Check it out! This is the ability! I don't know how to... <laughs> Boy, that, wouldn't that just make you die? Oak. So he has no idea where I am. <laughs> he still has no idea where I am. So he's like, who's poking me in the back? It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter at all. Oh, he's still alive. Now he's not. What up, bat chicken? John Hunter. What's up, guys? <laughs> Alright, guys, so, uh, so I, I, beat the, I beat the new boss, and here is, here is the new ability. You can kind of freeze time and reposition yourself and surprise your enemy. <laughs> Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Now we've got the mod on so that the ability recharges quickly. Oh man, I was hoping that. I was hoping to chop off his arm while he wasn't even looking. These dudes are just covered in blood now. Just like Dio. Make sure I'm not just like Neo. Because I don't know who Dio is. But. That doesn't mean Dio doesn't exist. It means I just don't know who Dio is. Oh, I wanted to cut off both of his arms. <laughs> oh, here, catch. Oops. Yeah, let me just get that now. Boop, 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 boop. Alright, we gotta find something fun to do while uh while we've got time frozen. Mm. 
right. I officially I don't know how to use daggers very effectively. This is the first time I think I've used daggers for more than two minutes in this game. I've just always gone with a either a sword and a shield or just two swords. Like a surgeon. Precision. Ooh, there we go. Uh, sir, you seem to have. That's going to be a problem. Oh, so Dio's a thing. All right, sorry. I uh, I don't know anything about Dio. <laughs> Sometimes I don't know if you guys are uh, are talking about something I don't know anything about, or if you made a typo. Poke. Oh, there we go. That's how next twist. Oop, I missed. I won't miss this time. Arr, right in the eye. Okay. <laughs> this is so silly. It's definitely one of those things that's like way more fun uh, when you turn on all the mods. Alright. Here, what we're gonna do. What we're gonna do is finish this level, and then we'll go back and get a regular sword and a dagger. Um, oh, you know what? I've always wanted to get into JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. Uh, ever since uh, it was like a, a Capcom fighting game, I was always like, what's this all about? I'd probably like it, yeah. Okay, since we're cheating, let's just cheat all the way, man. Let's just cheat all the way. Cheat all the way to the Platinum Trophy. <laughs> yeah, get the fuck up. We're not done. Yeah, yeah, go ahead. Try to punch me. Try to punch me. Go ahead. Go ahead. Yeah, see how that goes. Man, this is a long ass, uh, long ass level, isn't it? <laughs> I love it. Just goofing around in this game, man. Sometimes goofing around is more fun than the actual game. There we go. Uh, rating out of 10, I, the boss fight wasn't like something I'd write home about. Um, the new weapon is pretty cool. Um, the, the arena was okay. Um, I get the impression that the arena was going to be something bigger, more interesting than it was, than just a pathway over a bunch of lava. Um, and the boss was... I don't know. It felt it felt a little glitchy. Okay, so mod mods didn't give us any uh, rewards, which is fine. Hey, goofing around kind of is the game. Well, you can kind of blast through the campaign pretty quickly, so goofing around definitely is. I, I need to grind so much to get to get the platinum. I've done everything in this game. Um, uh, but but man, some some of the goals are a little bit much. Um, require you to grind a little bit too long, but that's okay. I'll get. I'll probably just get the platinum over time. Um. All right. So you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna get a nice big sword, like the Hellfire again. We're gonna equip that in our right hand, and then we're gonna see if we can decapitate some of these dudes. While we've got time frozen. See if we can make the most of both weapons. I wonder if I, I wonder if I can freeze. I wonder if I can freeze 
time and then throw down the dagger and use the sword with both hands and then pick up the dagger again. What a Ben out, what a portal player. Alright, here we go. Check this out, ready? So put that down. Oh shoot, the second I Uh oh. Uh pardon me, gentlemen. <laughs> Thank you very much. Um the second I let it go, it goes flying out of my hand in the in the effects stop. Stop being effective. The effects stop. Do I believe the rumor? Yeah, man, we've been talking about that a lot. The PlayStation VR 2 will be real revealed in uh, December. That is uh, something I've been saying pretty, pretty frequently uh, on Gamescast. So yeah, absolutely. Man. Absolutely. Oh, hey. <laughs> kind of just got up into the sword. Oh, Gary, I always stand, man. If, if I'm using the move controllers, uh, unless it's something where you're supposed to sit, like catching the release, I am, uh, I'm always standing. If it's a DualShock 4 game, that's a different story. I will absolutely sit with a DualShock 4 game. Uh, even if I'm supposed to be standing, I think, uh, I can't think of a DualShock 4 game. DualShock 4, I think I always sit for it, man. I think it's just the gamer in me. It's like, well, I'm holding the DualShock 4, I'm holding a game controller, I'm playing a video game, I should sit down. It's just kind of that instinctual thing never goes away. Um. Yeah, well, I'm with you, man. I'm definitely going to be, uh, I am definitely going to be uh, excited for Transformers until someone tells me not to. Or, or until I have a reason not to be. Um, I kind of, I'm kind of excited about everything, man. Like I'm still, still kind of a kid at heart when it comes to video games. It leads to a lot of disappointment, but that's it. <laughs> yeah, uh, Portal Player, watch, uh, watch PSVR this week, man, and. Uh, and skim to the end if you need to. Um, but yeah, there's a new trailer for it's coming out this winter. Uh, so that's it, guys. Um, pretty cool. You know, it's I, I don't I, I I don't really know what to say. The boss fight was was cool, not quite as cool as I wanted it to be. Um, but the but the daggers are really really cool, and being able to uh, take those and bring them back and use them in uh, in the rest of the campaign and all the different modes is is really cool too. So. Uh, I don't know how long it takes to charge them up, uh, even after killing a few dudes with them. I didn't see the charge meter going up at all, so I'm not really sure how that, that works out uh, like without without the mod being on. Uh, but it's cool, man. You know, the more they add to this, the more uh, the more exciting it becomes. The better game it becomes. Uh, not all bosses have to be amazing. Uh, I do think that the uh, I do think that the pirate edition has probably been the best one so far. And, uh, and, as, and as simple as the horde mode is, uh, I, I, get a, I get a kick out of it, man. Again, because <laughs> I, 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 think it, I think it really opens up a lot of opportunities. Uh, I think everyone who played it was like, this is great, but... And then they listed all these things that they wanted, and it like, just made my mind like, go a thousand miles an hour with, I wish there were potions to recover my health. I wish there were keys to find that unlock some of those chests. And then when I found the chest, it was like a special weapon, and blah, 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 and like kind of helped you uh, proceed throughout the course of... Like a hundred waves or something, you know. Um, so yeah, this, this game just keeps getting better and better. And uh, you know, I don't, I don't think hell is the reason to pick up this game, but I do think that there's enough reasons to pick up this game uh, at this point. It's, it's it's a great deal for twenty bucks. It's a lot of fun, it's especially if you like gooping off in games like Gorn. Um, you know, any kind of like <laughs> arena combat games. Uh, so that's it, guys. I knew this was going to be a, a quick stream. I've, like I said, I've got a lot of work I want to get done tonight. I've got a bunch of videos coming your way over the next few days. Uh, so stay tuned, and uh, and have a great night. I love you all. Happy Halloween week.